this is an interesting turn of events. Friggin' uh, just went to a thrift store. Not to look at records, to see about maybe getting a cheap shelf. And all the shelves they have, of course, are really crappy. But, uh, ended up walking out with an 8-track player. An 8-track stereo Panasonic. It's got an 8-track and it's got an AM, FM. It's pretty cool. It was only 5 bucks. I couldn't pass it up. Even if, uh, I mean, well, yeah, here's the thing. I plugged it up and the AM, FM works great. Tape wouldn't play. So I uh, dissected the 8-track uh, the player really cool the uh, actual like eight track unit itself just kind of like pops right in and out which is pretty cool it makes things really easy I didn't end up having to take the whole thing apart just the eight track itself and uh, just exactly what I thought the belts broken it's super corroded probably the belt that came with the thing I mean it just like pieces I mean it just crumbled like when I was like trying to peel off the old bits and stuff so now I'm gonna go to Rec Radio Shack which I'm sure is a lost cause but if they don't have anything there I can use fix it. I think there's a chance that I could, if I could get the right kind of rubber band, I can make it work. So I got, got some rubber bands around the house, but uh, they're not like tight enough. None of them are really a good size, so I'm going to have to go get like a variety pack of rubber bands or something. Like, I don't know, the reason why I think I could fix it is just because the wheels for the things are really wide. Like, I have that portable 8-track, but it uses a tiny, 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 tiny little belt. But the belt, like the piece of the belt that was on there was thick, like a thick rubber band, you know. So I think I actually could maybe ghetto rig it with something. So we'll see. We'll hit up all shitty shack I hope I get there before they close. I'm pretty positive they just close when the mall closes. I don't know why there's a radio shack in the mall. Like when there used to be one, like I'd already be there by now if they didn't move it to the mall, but whatever. You know this elementary school here. I think that's illegal. Is that illegal? You're friggin', friggin' around on the elementary friggin' son of a bitch swing like while the school's closed and like you Kids are probably way too old to be in elementary school. They look like middle school kids, but I'm about done my sack, friggin'. Yeah. So we're going to Radio Shack. Yeah. Yeah. Just like I figured, Radio Shack didn't have anything. So uh, I'm gonna try a Best Buy here. There's at least another 20 minutes before Best Buy closes. At least Walmart's 24 hours. But we'll try Best Buy here. They probably won't have anything either. But I'll take a look anyway. Oh frig! Friggin' phone is blowing up. Friggin' Portal 2 Space Core. Beg my pardon. No, he should beg him's pardon. Him's annoying as frig. Alright. So here we are, we're at Best Buy. You can tell. I'm friggin'. I'm gonna just, uh, nab this parking spot here and see what we can do. Yeah. Okay, so Best Buy didn't have it either. Best Buy didn't have it either, so uh, we're going to Walmart. We're going to Walmart, we're just going to get some rubber bands. 
maybe I'll check out their electronics department too, but I'm probably just going to walk out with some rubber bands. Friggin', uh, friggin' rights. Just got here to Walmart, and this is kind of funny. Their cart people sure do suck, because, uh, well, it's partly people who, uh, don't put up their carts, but, uh, look, everywhere. Carts. Carts. There's carts all across the parking lot. Their cart people suck. People who don't put up their carts suck. Look, there's a friggin', oh, well, it's full. Oh, it's full. Yeah, so their cart people suck. Yeah. Friggin' rights. So I got some rubber bands. Finally, it took me forever to find the damn things. Kind of figured maybe back to school supplies and this and that. Nope, they kind of had them just like kind of the most random place ever. And plus, everybody and their mother is friggin' here shopping for back to school supplies and people friggin' taking 20 friggin' years to friggin' check out their shit. And I finally get a machine and then I go up to it and it's like, oh, we only take cash and it's like, no. Oh, or we only take card, and it's like, what? It's like, friggin' son of a bitch. Friggin' spend like half my time there, friggin' hunting down some rubber bands. Then half my time, friggin' waiting to check out. But I got some rubber bands. Got, some, got a bag that's like different sizes, and a bag that's like some other shit. And We'll give it a try. If it don't work, I'll have a shitload of rubber bands. I mean, I'll have a crap shit. A shitload of rubber bands anyway, but the way she goes, give it a shot. Okay, so uh, friggin' I uh, told you about my ID here. My friggin' idea. My friggin' all, oh, you see, I went and. Oh, look, I got a fuck ton of rubber bands. Holy shit. Oh. And I'm like, kind of like broadcasting while I'm YouTubing things. Oh, oh, look, you're watching yourself. You're going to be watching yourself here in a minute, but friggin'. See, I got a rubber band on the son of a bitch here. Check it out. We got my Elvis Presley here. I got her all taken apart because I thought the motor wasn't working, but the ghetto belt that I made before was just way overdone. Apparently a rubber band seems to do the trick pretty good. I might still try to dissect a friggin' like VCR or something and see if I can get a belt from that. Or maybe eventually I'll just order a whole pack of belts so then I can fix my little portables one that's over here. I got two 8-tracks. So you can put friggin' batteries in that thing and it's portable. But, uh... Yeah, that Kenny tape is probably just frigged over. But yeah, check it out. We'll put the tape in and... No, this is normal speed. It sounds like Elvis. And it's kind of funny, you see, it's got these lights here on the friggin' thing. Like, one of them didn't work, and I just kind of, like, hit the top of it, and boom, it popped on. So, yeah. I'm just going to sit here and listen to this for a little while and watch it and see how well this rubber band holds up. So, yeah. Friggin' rights, five dollar eight track. All right, so now you see her here. She's all hooked up. Got the friggin' Panasonic and the Panasonic put together. Moved my my uh, portable one out of the way. I guess I'll fix that one next. So this is just kind of a temporary fix. Um, I've actually this is actually my third attempt making this clip. <laughs> the friggin' rubber band kept slipping off, but I noticed it kind of got all greased up now that I've been playing with it a bit. So I. Went ahead and pulled the 8-track back out and cleaned the reels and stuff, so I think it's good now. So yeah, check it out. Uh, you, there was all this in the last one. Uh, I got all these 8-tracks for free. Oh, so we're going to play some Barbra Streisand, just because, you know, everybody loves Barbra Streisand. I, I beg my pardon. Friggin', uh, alright. Barbra Streisand. Let's go. That one doesn't sound like it's any good. I know the Kenny Rogers in there. It's just... Ugh. Yep. Well, that's okay, because nobody likes Barbra Streisand. Uh, 
All right, you know what? I'm just I'll just pick out the Elvis again. I'll just pick out the Elvis because I mean, if you don't like Elvis, then like you can't appreciate music. Come on. Working good. I know it says CD. It says CD, but. Turn that back up. Yeah, it's all, it's all working good. Look, I can close the cover here and see it's even got the button here so I can. I guess this, like if I, I, I said before, if I couldn't get this thing to work for this clip, I'd make this a two-part video, but you know what, it's going to be a two-part video anyway, because, you know, I definitely want to get the actual belt for it, but hey, a rubber band, a rubber band, just make sure you clean the wheels so it doesn't grease up the rubber band and make it pop up every time, you know. Now we got it going good. So yeah. Thanks for watching.